Donald Trump appeared at the 2024 Republican National Convention to great adulation from the crowd, but online observers noticed that perhaps he wasn't totally excited to be there. There's no denying that the 78-year-old former president seized the moment at his July 13th campaign rally in Butler, Pennsylvania, after he was grazed on his right ear by a shooter's bullet. As Secret Service agents stood him up to remove him from the stage, he held up a raised fist and repeatedly shouted, fight, drawing cheers from the crowd. A mix of energy from that moment and sympathy over his injury had pundits certain that the Republican National Convention in Milwaukee would be another opportunity for Trump to ride his momentum. And in many ways, it has been. The crowd's reactions to his entrances at the convention, where he has worn a very visible bandage on his right ear, have been huge. Singer Lee Greenwood also didn't shy away from talking about the shooting on the first night. He is here tonight to show his courage his defiance against somebody who tried to kill him. Trump himself, though, maybe not that into it. As the first night came to a close, cameras caught him appearing to have trouble keeping his eyes open. This recalled some of the reports that Trump similarly seemed to have trouble staying awake during jury selection at his criminal fraud trial in Manhattan in April. A viewer posted to X, formerly Twitter, Trump now appears to be asleep during the Republican National Convention, just like he slept through his criminal trial. Footage of Trump appearing to nod off at the RNC has made the rounds on social media and has caused some arguments, as these things so often do. One ex-user whose video of the moment has gotten nearly 130,000 likes wrote, if Trump can't stay awake at his own convention, how is he going to stay awake for America? I think it's time he should step down and let someone much younger and who is not a convicted felon take his place. That video shows Trump's eyes closing during a speech from Harmeet Dillon, former vice chair of the California Republican Party. Dillon's remarks included a prayer in the tradition of her Sikh faith. Many in the auditorium closed their eyes for the prayer, but the video shows Trump's eyes drooping before the prayer began, and his eyes open during most of the prayer itself, in which Dylan thanked God for the former president's life. That said, many of Trump's ardent supporters have made the argument that he wasn't sleeping, but praying. And in some of the clips that have been shared purporting that Trump was asleep, he was, in fact, praying. Newsweek points out that one clip posted by one ex-user who wrote, Trump fell asleep at the RNC on the first night, he just got there, used footage of the former president during a prayer by Pastor James Remke. PolitiFact even weighed in, calling the claims in that specific tweet false. Others on X gave Trump a pass for his heavy eyelids for other reasons, with one saying, in fairness to Donald, it was really boring. Trump's behavior on the second night of the convention on Tuesday drew a different criticism, though some also said the same thing about night one. A lot of online observers thought the former president looked uncomfortable, with some saying he was grimacing throughout the proceedings. One wrote, he looked exhausted and uncomfortable at RNC. One theory was that the former president was still feeling some pain from the injury to his ear, with the thought that his bandage may be covering stitches.